Meantime, the Nigeria Labor Congress NLC and the Trade Union Congress in Ikeda State have followed the directive from the national bodies of the union to embark on an industrial action across their state. Labor leaders in the state shut down government offices, secretariats and banks in compliance with the nationwide strike. Meanwhile, it was a drama-like scene when NLC and TUC visited the Federal Medical Teaching Hospital in Adoikiti as the chief medical director threatened to sack the members of the union. Now, the organized labor also visited the state secretariat and some banks where they forced out staff who failed to obey the directive. <laughs> They are sending us to slave in our own land. Mm. They are turning us to slave in our own land. The power of unity is there for us. And that's why we are here. In unity we stand yes. and division will fall. Yes. Yes. And we are going to tell whoever that is concerned here that what is going on here is not your own directive. It's the directive from our own national. It's the directive from the state. And it's the directive that we need the minimum wage and it has to be given. And How much are we clamoring for? How much are we saying? They say the salary cannot take us anywhere. Things are very hard. But this government, these people, these politicians, they are recalcitrant, and we are, we are so we are, we are fed up. So on this issue of this minimum wage, we are resilient, and we are going to follow it to the letter yes. until our demands are met. met. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel, and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.